the simplest way to begin is get, I suppose, my major. So originally in 2005, my first go run through college, I was going to do fire science. Unfortunately, I found out through a few years worth of, you know, applications and rejection letters. Um, it, it turns into it doesn't matter how much you try and prepare, doesn't matter how many classes you take, no matter how structured you put your plan in, sometimes it's just going to be a flat out no. Which, you know, it's pretty disappointing nonetheless. I was pretty disappointed for a while. But then I turned it into something better. I took a random class in meteorology and I loved it. I took a storm chasing course. We traveled all throughout the Midwest. I cannot remember how many states we drove through. I might have slept through some of them. The point is, is that I saw quite a bit, and that's where I decided to take my major this time. So as I'm here, I'm finishing up my associate's degree that's going to gear more towards Earth and Space Sciences, and that'll lead me into ASU. And that's where it leads into my positive attribute. I was leapfrogging through my past and trying to think of really any words. I was writing them down, and couldn't find one per se, but then I thought of the memories that stuck out the most, and replaying them in my head, I realized that the word I had was resilience. Resilience has been a major factor going through those memories, and the biggest example I can give is just the one I told you about, is my major. So I planned all my courses out, I planned, I spoke to the right people, but it was still no, every single time. There was really no definitive reason, it's just the way it is. But then there's that resilience part right there. Taking something bad, no matter how bad it is, and filtering it into something that could be good. No matter how volatile that negative emotion can be, but do something good with it. So I chose to do something good with it, change my major, and that's where I am today. Doing the best I can, turning something bad, no matter if it's waking up late for class or being stuck behind a truck on the way here, Turn into something good. Turn my brain off. Think of what I can do to do better. Do better next time. And that's where it, the famous quote that I always rang in my head during you know during those moments going through memories. I'll, I'm going to butcher his name. No matter how many times I hear it or how many times Google will tell me it. Uh, uh, Nietzsche. Oh, I believe it's Nietzsche. He says, "No matter what kills you, makes you stronger." I like that. But unfortunately, it, it's not best fitting for me anymore. So I turned into, or I amended it into, um, my name is Daniel and I'm built to take it. I'm, and I don't go down that easily. And that's where I'm at.